Hello guys, so um, sa video na to, uh, mag-solve tayo ng problem na under kay uh, conservation of momentum. Okay? The problem is, ang okay, mass A moves towards mass B, whose mass is uh, twice of that of mass A, and initially at rest. Now, after the impact, the two masses uh, moves together, so nagsama sila na. Now, what fraction of mass A's initial kinetic energy does the two masses move? Okay, so basically guys, na yung tanong dyan, um, anong part daw ng, um, ng mass A, uh, initial kinetic energy, yung naging kinetic energy ng system, okay, after the impact, okay? So, ratio lang to guys, no? Ng final kinetic of the system to the kinetic energy initial of mass A, okay? So, first, let us illustrate the problem, no? So, meron tayong dalawang uh, uh, masses dito, no? Okay, so let's say ito yung ating uh, mass A. Okay, so M sub A. Okay, the velocity of A, let's say uh, uh, it moves to the right. Okay, meron tayong B sub A. And then, since uh, kailangan nila mag, uh, magkaroon ng collision, so uh, mass B should be uh, a position no, to the right of mass of A. Okay, so ito yung ating mass sub B. Okay, M sub B. So, according sa problem, si mass B is twice ng mass of A. So, that is 2 times of M sub A. Okay, the initial velocity of B is B sub B. Since it is at rest, now this is 0. Okay? <coughs> now, after the impact... Okay, sila ay naging together. Okay, nagsama sila, no? Ayan, so let's say ito yung dalawang uh, uh, masses natin na nandikit na lang, no? Okay? Ayan. <coughs> so basically, no, okay? So, kung nagsama sila, um, the total mass of the system will be the sum of the uh, masses of A and B, no? So that is M sub A okay, plus M sub B. Okay, kaya lang guys na meron tayong uh, expression for M sub B, okay, which is 2 M sub A. So, ibig sabihin, yung combined mass is 3 times M sub A. Na, 3 times ng mass of A. Okay, then let's say um, the combined mass has a velocity of B sub, okay, dito na, uh, B, hmm, uh, B na lang ng B com. Yan. Combined velocity. Okay? Um, so, kung nag-stick together sila, guys, na impossible naman na uh, um, yung combined system is mag-move to the left. No? Okay? Walang ganun na. Kasi nga, yung momentum ng A, okay? Um, o siya na, papunta sa right. So, ibig sabihin, uh, after the impact, uh, the system will also move to the right now. Okay? To the right. Ayan. Okay. <coughs> Ayan. <coughs> okay, so balikan natin guys na. Yung required. So, ratio ng um, kinetic energy ng system sa kinetic en energy ng mass A. Yung kanyang initial. So, kung babalikan natin yung formula ng um, kinetic energy, yung ating KE, diba guys, is 1 half of mass and then B squared. So, uh, dito guys, no, kung meron na tayong um, um, expression for M, which is M sub A, yung M sub B naman, in terms ng M sub A, and then yung total mass is 3 M sub A. So, ang kulang na lang dito guys, is to express the combined velocity in terms ng a. Okay. So, ito guys, kasi si, si B sub B, ah, wala nang use yan, no? Kasi zero siya, na. No? Okay. So, yan, ito lang kailangan natin dito, guys, no? Marlate yung B com sa B sub A. Okay. No, paano natin kukunin yun? Okay. So, ano yung principle na involved dito? Okay. O, anong concept kaya? Since meron tayong uh, impact, okay, meron tayong 
Kumbaga, meron tayong scenario before and after. Okay? Meron tayong masses and velocity na before and after. Ibig sabihin, guys, no? Uh, the best uh, way to solve this problem is to use the concept of um, conservation of momentum. Okay? So, that is kailangan, guys, no? Yung ating uh, momentum. Okay? Momentum. Okay, um, initial or before the impact must be equal to the momentum. Okay, after the impact. Okay, yung ating momentum uh, before the impact. Anyway, so the momentum is just the product of the mass and velocity. So, meron ka dyang, uh different uh, bodies no, or object. You just have to add the... Uh, uh, product of mass and velocities. Okay? And take note of the sign. So, dapat meron tayong uh, passive direction. Kasi, uh, velocity is a vector quantity. No? So, meron siyang direction. Dito naman, uh, we already assumed that uh, the objects na moves to the right. So, wala nang problema sa mga signs. Just get the uh, product of mass and velocity na. So, for m, m sub a, the uh, momentum is m sub a and then b sub a and then for uh, mass b meron tayong m sub b and then b sub b okay equal to must be equal to the momentum after the impact so yung momentum ng system natin um, is the product of the total mass which is 3 m sub a okay the total mass and then the uh, combined velocity na sub so b com. Ayan. Okay. Since b sub b is 0, so obviously na, okay, this part will also become 0. Na, itong term na yan. So, ang matitira na lang guys dito is m sub a, b sub a equal to 3 m sub a, and then b com. Okay. To isolate, isolate b com, no, isolate b com, Okay, divide both sides by uh, itong term na yan, no? yung 3 m sub a. Okay, so, therefore, the combined velocity no, after the impact is uh, m a b sub a over 3 m a. 3 m a. Cancel, guys, yung ating m sub a. So, it will give us b sub a over uh, 3. Okay. So now, uh, proceed na tayo sa ratio okay, ng uh, kinetic energies. Na. So, yung required na ratio or fraction okay, is the ratio of the um, kinetic energy of the system na, okay, after the impact. Um, so, ito yung combined na, combined over the kinetic energy of A initially. Na. So, Ke of A initially. Okay? Yan, initial. Okay. So, ano yung Ke natin after the impact or yung uh, combined masses? So, one half ng mass ng uh, combined mass which is 3 m sub A and then the square of the velocity of the combined masses. So, B com squared over the initial Ke of A so, one half the mass of A and then the uh, square of the velocity of A. So, B, a sub, B sub A squared. Okay. Cancel natin guys yung mga common ito. Yung one half, yung M sub A. Okay. Then, uh, sulat yung matitira which is 3 okay, V com squared over B sub A squared. Now, what is B sub uh, V com? Okay, that is BA over 3. So, meron tayong BA over 3 e squared. Okay? Over B sub A squared. Ayan. So, pag meron tayong product or division, pwede mong distribute yung exponent. Okay, magiging... Okay, ba tayo na? Okay. Um, copy yung 3. Ito, meron tayong B sub A squared over 3 squared is 9 over b sub a squared. 
So again, cancel yung common which is b sub a squared. Okay? Ang matitira dyan is uh, 3 over 9. Okay? So simplify 3 over 9 will give us the ratio of 1 third. Yan. So ibig sabihin guys, now after the impact, the ratio of the kinetic energy, okay, um, I mean, yung fraction ng initial KE na mass A is, um, yung magiging uh, KE natin is one third na, ng initial KE na mass A. Ayan. So, the required answer uh, for this uh, problem is, okay, one third. Ayan. Okay, so I hope meron kayong natutunan sa video na to and see you um, sa ating next video. Ingat!